thank you for tuning into my channel. This is your girl Tiffany. Now, today we're just going to be talking about what's worth the block, worth the streets. Are you ready for the tea, or are you ready for the tea? Personally, could I would not believe that any mother would do something like that to her child. Chris, on the other hand, I'm very disappointed. If these allegations are true of what Ray J is saying about Chris and the whole family and the whole scam of it all, and the fact that they have the audacity to bring, you know, another black man down, Ray J, Kanye. Like these men were telling us the tea, but we weren't believing them. But now I have my popcorn and I'm like sitting down and I'm just observing everything as it unfolds bit by bit. I had so much high respect for the Kardashians, Chris, but this is low y'all. This is low to the fullest. Like I can't make this shit up. I want to hear from all the moms. I want to hear from all the women and stuff out there. I just want to know your input on this because I feel so sad about the situation, you know what I mean? And Ray J is not having it and what's not, you know, he's sick and tired of everybody just just not believing him and he's going to set things straight. He got receipts and everything. So we are going to see everything play out day by day. I mean, can you blame him? He's just sick and tired, you know what I mean? Like, and then we all, the disappointing part about this is that we all watched the show, right? We watched the show and everybody knew that certain things were scripted. But to trash other people's name in it when you know you had a part to do with it is just low down low. At the end of the day, you know, I understand Ray J's feelings because Ray J got kids now, you know, and Ray J want to clear his name off of his kids. and. He has a right to do so, seriously. The biggest mistake, um, I guess, Chris could have done was went to gym show. She was asked a question if, you know, basically if she had anything to do with the state, right? And she denied these allegations, allegedly. But Ray J wasn't having it. He's pulling out receipts and what's not. And, you know, he's going to do what he got to do and expose them. <laughs> not gonna allow Chris Jenner to bully him and so forth so it is on it is real guys it is real and I feel so sorry for you know RJ and his family and the way how they portray him for years but Ray J you know like if you need to handle things bro handle it in court that's what you need to do that's a smart way to do it all right like you can't be going out talking I know you're upset and so forth but you gotta be smart these people are powerful as well and you know what they're capable of doing are you guys going to be a Kardashian fan now? So you guys heard about R. Kelly, right? All right. So now, did you hear that R. Kelly jail commissary will be held for victims, leaving him with only like, you know, $500? Shoot. I feel like it's all catching up to him now. 
But would you expect? I saw that coming. But that's just according to Rolling Stones. But it's not his fault because the court ordered to seize $25,000 from him. So, but right now I know he owes like, I heard we're in the block or in the street, so he was like, like a hundred, over like 140,000, so. But you know, in June he was sentenced for 30 years, right? For eight counts of sex trafficking and one count for racketeering. really really bad you know the whole simple fact like i heard word in black on the street is that he was trying to reach out to kim like around july or what's not and you know kim didn't buy the bait and then he probably got his feelings hurt and what's not is Mary J divorced from princess love they on again off relationship be confusing the hell out of me so i don't know this news is so messy because kim authorized that you know she didn't grant the release of the tape not knowing that allegedly Chris was behind it. So this is just messy. I can't even believe I'm reporting this. I can't even believe that we're talking about this. I feel so, so ashamed of this, of, of, of this all. Like I really looked up to them to this degree and now hearing this news, I'm like, damn, wow. I really don't know what's going on. I don't know if this is a promotion for season two. I don't even know if, if, if this is like to promote whatever. If it's to like help Ray J build his career and what's not. Like I really don't know what's going on. Like he's trying to warn us. Like bro, we were trying to tell you for the longest how calculated the Kardashian was. Very smart, I must say. But they were very calculated. And we were trying to tell you get out, bro. I mean you did get out, but what you expect? Like she don't want nothing to do with you, Ray J. She already been there, done that. She already used you. She already got what she want from you. So, and now because I feel like she rejected you, he going ape shit. And you've seen his true colors. That's crazy. All right, guys, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed. Don't forget to hit that bell. This way you can be notified every time I post. And guys, don't forget to check out tiffyonybeauty.com where you can see lots of merch. And you can also check out tiffyonybeautystore.com where you'll see a lot of Amazon finds and things that, I'm, things that I'm obsessed with. So, guys, thank you guys for watching. And until next time, bye-bye now. <laughs>